highs. And once again, that's going to allow our temperatures to dip into the 50s and also 60s during the overnight. So we are looking at a somewhat chilly start to our morning tomorrow. So I do want to talk about the tropics. Only one named storm we are keeping an eye on. And just to note, not a threat to the Gulf. In fact, the Gulf looking very quiet for the next week and also the first week of October. So that's fantastic. So the tropical update on Hurricane Sam, it is a major hurricane. It's 940 miles east southeast of the northern Leeward Islands. Now it is moving to the west northwest at eight miles per hour, so it has slowed down some and we are expecting this system to continue to slow down as it makes a turn to the north by midweek. So it is packing winds of 145 miles per hour with wind gusts of 175 miles per hour. So even though this is a small storm, it is a very intense storm. You can see that well defined eye and it is expected to hold on to its major hurricane status through the rest of the week. I mean, there's really nothing to inhibit this system to weekend. So wind shear not really present and it is moving over warm water. So here is the latest track from the National Hurricane Center. It does show that it's going to make that northward turn eventually as we head into our Friday. But again, you can see these tick marks right there. So it is expected to slow down some as we head into your Monday and Tuesday. And again, it is governed or st it's steered by this area of high pressure and is going to continue to ride along that air high pressure. We'll have a dip in the jet stream that's going to yank that system to the north. So that's why we're thinking it's not really going to head into the Gulf and hopefully won't be an issue to any of the Caribbean islands, which will be really nice there. So here's a look at your seven day forecast. Again, really nice today. 85, plenty of sunshine. I put a 20% chance for a few showers tomorrow will be isolated, much warmer, 88 degrees. Dew points continue to climb as we we head into your Tuesday as well as those rain chances.